It's that time again, March Madness, but not for sports, because why? We're doing sci-fi versus fantasy. Uh, this is from io9. It's a website based, based on futurism, uh, fandoms, and this is actually based on what their viewers, readership would uh, decide on. But we, we fill out our own brackets. Yeah, let me get I my bracket. I sort of worked on, uh, based on what I think would win, or who had the biggest fandom, or what io9's audience is likely to do, but also sort of based on what I like because tiebreakers. All right, guys, let's, let's get into this. Let's do some sports talk, but not really. What did you guys, uh, where did you guys have trouble deciding on this? <sighs> Early on, it, not in the, not in so the. In my, so it, continuing on with the Firefly, Firefly ends up winning, uh, fighting the person who wins Star Trek versus Hyperion, and I have Star Trek in there. Obviously. Obviously, Which, Star Trek. I, I but mean, that, I what that means, it's Firefly versus Star Trek. Star and Trek the, wins. And, I know, but that's so hard. Space opera, this whole category always plays out exactly like you think it would, coming down to Star Wars versus Star Trek. Yes. Yeah. At the end of the day, you, there's lots of great movies and film and, yeah. and books and TV series in there, but it always comes down to Star Wars versus Star Trek at the end. Yeah, I, that's I, exactly what happened. I have them in there too. Like I felt really bad about it, but um, All right, boys, Star Wars sorry, versus Star sorry, Trek. Doom, sorry, Ooh, Star Wars one. versus Star Trek. This is hard. What, what do you got? Uh, I'm always taking the underdog favorite, so I went with Trek. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're I, trying to do an upset here on your yeah, on your yeah. yeah. No, no, no. Because you know, I think we're not betting money on this. Oh, by so the way. you're not betting. Someone's yeah, clearly betting. Yeah, we got well, we got a side for not bet asking happening. Me. Here. Well, no. It's, uh, so I took Star Wars. Sorry, I took Star Wars because I just the, oh, man, the world is so big and there's so much and the fans are out there and they're so powerful and I just if I, I had to choose, I you they've know they've been building a veritable. Death Star of fandom, Nobody. and they're gonna blow the shit up out of <laughs> Star Trek. That's what I'm saying. Nobody <laughs> hates Star Wars more than Star Wars fans. That's true. Whereas I think when something bad happens in the Star Trek universe, mm. Star Star Trek fans can just kind of gloss over it and yeah, say, "Well, incorrect. the new movies just no, aren't for no, us." No, 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 no. Did you see Star Trek Into Darkness and all the backlash after that? Okay, is there more backlash for Into Darkness or the prequel Star Wars movies? Well, that's not fair because that's one movie versus Isn't three movies. Isn't it fair because that's exactly <laughs> what they're up against? <laughs> Actually, <laughs> that's, uh, that's all I'm saying. I think that we'll, we'll see. We'll let the IO9 voters decide which. But they, they hate because they're filled with passion, <laughs> and passion leads to winning. What? Oh, winning is a passion. <laughs> <and dark. laughs> Wait, what? How does that work? Uh, okay. I, I think there's a lot more interesting matchups in the lower left-hand corner, which I believe okay. is dystopia and mad science. Yeah, so it's a weird and category. Mad science regional. Oh, that's what that is. Okay, so yes. Hunger Games versus. Back to the Future. Back to the Future. Oh, so it's I like... That's tough. I took Back to the Future in that one. You took Back to the Future? I took Back to the Future also. See? I mean, it's come silly. on, dude. The hoverboard, it's pretty badass. But um, then what do you do with Blade Runner versus Back to the Future in the next round? Back to the Future. Do you, though? Know? I do! Uh, I took Blade Runner. <laughs> I, I think you could make the case that oh, that's tough. Back that's to so the Future hard. has some flawed movies, because there's three of them. Sure. And Blade Runner is perfect. But who has If the you watch the fandom? right edition. Who does? <laughs> who does? It's Back to the Future. It's Back to the Future. Baby. So that's why I have that winning. Mm. Um, well, I had actually, you have time travel, so they can come back and like yeah, rate this anyway. And change it with sports almanacs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. I had Doctor Who going very far because of the Whovians. They are a force to be reckoned with. Yes, but I think they're mostly relegated to Tumblr and probably not messing no, around with that. Oh, no, they will, they will come out strong. And they'll say, you got to vote for Doctor Who here. Mm -hmm. And they'll say, let's do it. And then it'll be huge. Yeah, Doctor Who versus X-Files, come on, who, right? Who versus Back to the Future? I wrote who winning that one mm -hmm. as well. Even who versus Blade Runner? I think you're going to get like... You're gonna get slammed with all these. That, for me, that category kind of ends up Terminator. Do you have anyone beating Terminator? Well, yes, you have I who? do. I, I have, have Evangelion beating Terminator. Fuck you, anime. You're, it's being I, underestimated. You I think have Evangelion beating Akira. Yeah. Yes, I do. It's good. It's really good. But I, I was, I was trying to play to the audience, and I figured that IO9 would go with Akira, and it was, it was, it was a 50-50. I actually feel like Neon Veg, um, Evangelion is a better, better anime, but. Um, um, I'm trying to. I'm playing the odds. That's all it is. Well, I actually prefer it personally, and that's why I chose it. Yeah. All right. Let's, go, good. let's go to the right side. Okay, all right. Eastern, let's move on. Let's start on the bottom. The Eastern bracket. We're moving to the Magic and Monsters Magic Regional. And Monsters. That's the oh, bottom right-hand corner. No, this, this is my biggest upset category. Oh, this is so hard. Did you send? What did you send all the way from this category, Tim? Ghostbusters. You what? did? Yeah. Harry Potter. What is yep. wrong with you? All why? Way. What is your? What? 
have, have Harry people Potter, made come on. 15 seed Ghostbusters I have going on. Oh, you have money on this thing so of hard. Dollar <laughs> off of Ghostbusters? It's, I to think me, not, Mr. It's not about what made the most money. It's about the better uh, the better source material. Harry the Potter is better. No, no, but this is fandom. It's, 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 this is n fandom nations competing. And so you're saying that, I love the Ghostbusters, don't get me wrong, but the Harry Potter fans, Potterheads are hardcore. Maybe, maybe it was right, a nod bitch. to Harold Ramis. Maybe it's because Bill Murray's my spirit animal. I don't know. I just I had a good feeling about Ghostbusters, and I went with my gut. If that upset happens, then that that's going to basically a, break this whole bracket for yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. There's a lot of good I good matchups here, though. I will flip a goddamn table if that is a Rage. <laughs> we did right, it so unite. <laughs> Clearly, you guys have Harry Potter going pretty far in yeah. that category. What do you have on the top of that category? Um, where up here or in the same what, area? What do you have? Uh, Sandman versus Alice in Wonderland and Buffy versus Twin Peaks. I had Sandman beat Alice yeah. and Sandman meet Buffy. It was tough oh. for me because Sandman. I don't want to say Sandman's I mean, better than Buffy Nita because it's all apples powerful. and orange. No, it, yeah, that's exactly. They're they're of different kinds. I, like I think they should all. Well, can we have just best in show? Can we just be like yeah, right. of your form? Like you're the best. You know, like why do they have to fight? Why can't yeah, we all just, just get? Hold hands. <laughs> well, let's talk about the top corner. When you're looking at top seated Lord of the Rings, you have to consider <sighs> movies versus books. Yeah. And I then said Lord of the Rings all the way through that. As did I. Over but Game of Thrones. Begrudgingly yeah. against Game of Thrones. I'll take Game of Thrones. Whoa. I'll take Game of Thrones over Lord of the Rings. Like, I, look, I get it. I, hey, do I, okay, at the Gamesmith, go ahead, send it to me. It's fine. All the hate, it's fine. But um, I think Game of Thrones is awesome. Uh, the books are so good, and the character development, everything is amazing. Um, and Lord of the Rings just feels like it was written 100 years ago. It and, almost was. <laughs> and the society that reflects, I just... I don't like it anymore, you know, and it's cool. I get it. That's where I came from. That's where I. That's where I learned about magic and elves and dwarves and all that stuff. And, but if I had to choose, I will. I will go with. I will I'm go with Game of, of Thrones. I'm proud of your conviction, though I'm angry at your blasphemy. And. <laughs> 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 okay, so now final four, go. Lord of the Rings, Harry Potter, who, Star Wars. That is my final four exactly. No, mine, uh, the only one in common I have is Lord of the Rings there. So you because have Lord have, of the Rings. I have Trek, Terminator, Lord of the Rings, and Ghostbusters. Do you like losing? I do. Oh, I do. Hey, you know what? If I'm right here, it's a coup. It's yeah. a huge explosion. So, I mean, we'll see. Okay. And who's your, who's your eventual winner? I don't know. You I don't didn't, know. I didn't, I didn't go get that, that far. far. I didn't get that far because I didn't fill out the, the final side uh -huh. uh, before the interview. But, but I mean, you know what your final four are. I do. Take a crack at it. Who's, who's okay? You, who's the one? What, Harry that, Potter, Game of Thrones? Yep, Star Wars, Doctor Who. If I, if I have to bet on what the internet will say, I will say Star Wars. That's what I did. Yeah. Especially I'm, with the movies coming out. What did you say, Tim? If I'm riding my... If you said if Ghostbusters. I'm, Ghostbusters! I'm going to choke Ghostbusters. you! It's not Ghostbusters! <laughs> we'll see. Ghostbusters, we'll see. Dubs, do it. I want to see it. 15th seat, going all the way. Cinderella story. Yeah, dude, it's so good. All right, well, dun, 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 if you dun. want to fill one of these out, they're available on io9. I'll include a link below. We do not get paid for this promotion. We just love it a lot. And as much as Tim likes losing, apparently, let us know what your picks are for winning this bracket and which is the top sci-fi fantasy franchise bonanza. Go, comments. Also, subscribe. Bye.